Today I'm making hummus, a traditional Arabic side dish, but I'm going to spice it up and instead of using garbanzo beans, I'm using butternut squash. This recipe was created by my mom and I'd love to share it with you. Yalla, let's get started. The ingredients that I'm going to use for this delicious recipe are butternut squash, tahini, fresh squeezed lemon juice, crushed garlic, ground cumin, and salt to taste. I'm using a cup and a half of water, and I'm going to add the butternut squash. We want to bring them to a slight boil, which should probably be about 15 to 20 minutes. We want them to be tender, not overcooked, because we're going to eventually puree them in a food processor. So just stir them in, add a couple of dashes of salt, one, very nice. And let it do its thing and let's get the other ingredients started. I'm going to take my tahini, taking the garlic, my fresh squeezed lemon juice, I'm going to take about four pinches of ground cumin, which will probably be the equivalent of about an eighth of a tablespoon. That's two, here's three, and one more, four. Beautiful. And we're going to take salt, just a couple of pinches of salt, just to bring it all together. That should be good. And then we're going to blend them all together. I have drained the excess water from my butternut squash and I'm going to process it for a few minutes and what we're looking for is a nice mashed consistency. That's what we're looking for. I'm going to add all my ingredients and mix everything in together. I've put my butternut squash hummus in a serving dish. And here's where I'm gonna get a little creative with some spices. I'm going to use some cayenne pepper, some ground cumin, some parsley sprigs and olive oil to feed the eyes as well as the stomach. My butternut squash hummus looks amazing. It smells so good. I can't wait to share this with my friends and hope you enjoy it as well. Sahtin!